hubby is home. We're gonna pack up the car and get going. Turn right. Hi, Chick-fil-A and now we're on our way to Portland. Portland, Maine. Portland, Maine for our little weekend getaway. Say hi. Hey. Hey. Rupert just got out of work so he's a little tired but grumpy. And grumpy because he had a long day. Some drama at the the workplace, but it is snowing. Like crazy, I will show you guys. But we are onwards, so let's go. Many hours later.
come look at the other No, that's okay. Thank you. Right you yeah. Is that a nice truck or what? Yeah, it's pretty. <clears throat> okay guys, we just had dinner at Panera Bread and it was like the worst Panera Bread I've ever had in my freaking life. Anywho, we had to go to Crumble Cookie because I just had to try it. All the rave on TikTok and YouTube, I had to. So I got the chocolate caramel cookie and it's actually warm. Look how fancy it is. Got a little caramel on top. All right, let's try this bitch. It's a big thin poke. <clears throat> That's the, uh, it's falling apart. <laughs> I'm gonna have to like break it, I think. This is good. Wait, or not. <laughs> it's falling apart. Why is oh it no, because it's warm. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> Oh, I think it's salted caramel. All right, baby, you gotta try a bite. Don't drop it, okay? Jeez, why is it so heavy? What do you think? It's too good cooking. <laughs> it's really good. Ah! You know what it tastes like? What? It tastes like the cookie I made. Oh yeah, it does, doesn't it? Yeah. Look how gooey it is. Sorry it's dark, guys, but we needed a little sweet treat. Yeah, it's one sexy truck. Mm -hmm. It's really good. I wish that they had more flavors. Like, they only had... <gasps> Bless you. <laughs> they only had um, this one. The cheese... That lady bought six. Oh wow, the cheesecake one. I'll put a picture of them because I don't remember. The M and M one, the chocolate chip one. The M and M one looked boring. I know. I didn't. I'm not gonna go to Crumble Cookie and get a boring cookie. No. So I do wish that I had more options. It is like nine o'clock at night, so I'll look in the morning to see if they have more during the day. But well, what surprises me, baby? Why are there so many people at nine o'clock at night buying cookies? Right. <laughs> There was a lot of people in there and a lot of employees. It's kind yeah. of funny. And they were looking for people. Right. But there's like no one. It's like a ghost town. So it's kind of weird that everyone's like getting crumble cookies. But um, <laughs> tomorrow, if they don't have more cookies, then we're going to go. We're still going to the donut place. The, I think it's called the 88, the 88 Donut Shop, downtown Portland. They have a really good, well, they look like really good um <laughs> really good <laughs> donuts so I'm gonna have to try that because I am a, a sweets girl mm -hmm. and pretty much like everywhere we travel like in the United States anyways we always try to get a donut like a fancy donut you didn't eat it all today? no sad that this would burn Panera Bread yeah like I've never had a bad experience at Panera Bread but I guess in this side of like the Portland area Nope, would never come here again. Like, I didn't even really take any fit footage of it because it was just so bad. Like, his sandwich, he got the chicken. Was it chicken? That was like a pizza marinara. Pizza mozzarella. marinara mozzarella sandwich. And it, it had marinara all over the bread, everywhere. They just like rolled it up in the paper and just like threw it in there. My sandwich was like falling apart. It, and it looked, was really soggy too. Yeah, it just like it seemed like it had been sitting there like all day, which it probably had because it's like nine o'clock at night. But it was just not good. Look at that lady. She's trying to get in there, and they're definitely close. Hello. 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 I placed an order. Can you imagine? It's it's all the lights are out. This lady's standing at the door at um, Firehouse Subs. All the lights are off and she's like knocking on the door. I wonder if she like placed an order, but they're not open. Ooh, hey, windy. Damn, it's really windy outside. Anyways, Panera Bread and Westbrook, Maine would not recommend. How's it fail? That was definitely a fail, but we wanted something like quick, but like good because Panera Bread has always been good for us, but it was not good. So I guess we're gonna just uh, 
go back to the hotel and no. chill out. Um, so I decided to get a cheap hotel. So I looked at all of the cheap hotels on hotels.com because I get like rewards there. And this hotel looked really nice, but it was cheap. And it had a pool and a jacuzzi, right? So we pull up to this hotel and it's filthy. There's weird, creepy guys in there. The pool is shut down. The room is disgusting. Um, can't get a refund, so I guess we're gonna sleep there tonight and tomorrow night. <laughs> um, the only reason I chose this hotel is because it was supposed to have a pool and a jacuzzi. Like, I brought my swimsuit and everything. I was ready to, like, chill out. Like, whenever we travel, we try to get, well, like, if we travel in the state. <laughs> We try to get like the cheapest hotel because we like to spend the money like to experience other things, not just the hotel. <laughs> but now we know to not get the cheapest hotel available and read the reviews. I had beforehand. no problem spending more money on a hotel. That was... But it looks so nice in the pictures. I'll show you guys pictures of what it looked like on the website. Not, not it. So next time we travel, we will not be getting the cheapest hotel. And I need to look at the reviews beforehand. So you got the cheapest one? You didn't get like the mid? I got the cheapest one because it looked nice and there was like a jacuzzi and a, and a pool. But whatever. No, lesson learned. Why is it nice? Okay, so I guess we're gonna go find something to do or go back to the hotel, we'll see. Good morning guys, happy Saturday. We got some much needed sleep last night. I watched Legally Blonde like twice. <laughs> I got ready, put on some makeup. I'll show you guys a fit in a minute. I'm wearing jeans and a black shirt with my black boots. Um, changed into my black purse from Amazon. I got some earrings on from Amazon as well. So uh, this morning we're gonna go to Mr. Bagel. We have never been there before and a bagel sounds really good right now. And then we're gonna go shopping and see what we can find. I want to find a new sweater and I need socks and maybe a belt. <laughs> and I definitely wanna go to Five Below today. We'll see where life brings us, but let's do a fit check. They look like they're combustible. All these sandals are kind of cute. Ooh, I like those. Oh my god, those are the ones that are Dollar Tree for a dollar twenty-five. Dollar Tree selling them for a dollar. Yeah, dollar twenty-five. Hey, look, they have sandwich bags. Three of them for three dollars. That's not bad. Mm -hmm. You want to get a seat?
Oscar Mayer. <laughs> So we just went to, we just went to Five Below. There wasn't a whole lot in there, but we got some two packs of reusable bags and lollipops. <laughs> we're big spenders. Ugh. Now we're gonna go to the mall. Can I have some of your lollipop? No, you have your own lollipop. Yeah, but I don't want to open mine. Okay, well you're not getting my lollipop. So. <laughs> we're gonna go to the mall. I wanna go look at cars. You wanna go look at cars? No. We can. All right, we're at the mall. We need to return something at Best Buy and then we're gonna go bebop around. I see a Mustang. And see what we find. Jump me. <laughs> You're fine. I like that one too, the, the wicker looking one. Look at that chandelier. It's good. You didn't taste it. I did. did you work I'm trying to peel it back a little bit. So we just went to, um, can you see me? Hello? Hi! We just went to a, um, a sushi seafood buffet. It was okay. I wanted sushi, but Rupert does not like sushi, so I wanted to go to a place where he could get something that was not sushi. It was good, but I don't know that I would go there again unless I wanted to just get seafood because it's a pretty good price for seafood. 
it was okay. I'm glad that I got some sushi. I got some lobster and shrimp and uh, crab. It was nice. I wish that they had wet wipes because my hands were disgusting after. So anyways, we're gonna go to Home Goods and Bebop around because, um, yeah, we went to the mall earlier. I went to Torrid. I got a Lush face mask. Coffee flavored. Coffee flavored. <laughs> oh no, I'm in the wrong lane. I'm gonna have to turn around. Um, and then I went to tour it. I got a leather jacket for us to wear tonight out for a little hot date. Um, and then what? 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 What are we doing? We have to turn around because I went the wrong way. We're gonna go to Home Goods. And then I'm not really sure what else we're gonna do. We were going to go to the um donut place that I was talking about earlier but we totally freaking forgot so I am going to try to go tomorrow by instead yourself. not by myself because my husband loves me and he's gonna go with me where are we going oh, we're going is... to like Stephen King's home or something <laughs> what, the fuck? what the hell we're gonna die <laughs> yeggers oh, oh it's um, Holiday Inn. We're chilling at the Holiday Inn. I bet they have a pool there. I bet they do. I actually stayed there for my 8th grade class trip. This place? Yep. Yeah. Sure it's, really fancy, but... it's not like super fancy. It's a Holiday Inn, but much fancier than the place that we were at. Yep. Nice Anyways, I'm going to let you guys go. We're going to Home Goods, and I'll show you some footage of that. Goodbye. Can you help me? Sure. Oh, that's, I don't want that, never mind. I want to see how much this bottle is. This one, $12.99, it's kind of expensive. I want a new one to put in the kitchen because I don't like the wood one anymore. It gets so gross. How much is that? $12.99. I like that shelf. Love you. Smile. So we just got back to the hotel and my husband is watching uh, Spongebob.
So I'm editing this video now and realizing that I did not end this video. Um, so Sunday was the day that we came home. Um, so we had a few places in mind that we wanted to go. We wanted to go to Trader Joe's, but we were a little bit anxious because we couldn't figure out our way around and then stuff happened. And Trader Joe's was like so packed that we had to go park in another parking lot because there was no parking. And we were just like, we can't do this. It's gonna make, make us so much more anxious. So we decided not to go to Trader Joe's, unfortunately. And then I was going to go to a plus size um, boutique and it took us forever to find that. We actually parked and then got out of the car to like walk around because the GPS wasn't really leading us in the right direction. So after walking like a mile, we got, we found the place and it was closed. So we were like, let's just forget about it. It's already been a long day. We just want to go home and relax with our dogs. So we just ended up going home and um, we went grocery shopping and then we went home. And we just like relaxed for the rest of the day. But yeah, so that's where we ended. We did have a really good weekend away. It did not come out the way that we planned it to, but that's okay. We liked just getting away from home for a little while and spending good quality time together. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I can't wait to travel again soon. And I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.